Decades later, Stockton native Kristen Smart's body still has not been recovered. Even with the guilty verdict in the last 24 hours of Paul Flores and the death investigation, the Smart family attorney can't help filling Ruben Flores, Paul's father, who was found not guilty in helping dispose of the body, knows something. Tragically, the guy who walked Ruben Flores probably knows where the body is. And here's the deal. New at 11, we are hearing from Ruben Flores himself tonight, speaking directly to the Smart family. I feel bad for him because they didn't get no answers about what happened to their daughter. And we don't know what happened to their daughter. On Tuesday, a jury found 45-year-old Paul Flores guilty of first-degree murder. And simultaneously, another jury found Flores's father, Ruben Flores, not guilty of helping his son dispose of her body. Smart was last seen walking home from a party at Cal Poly Tech University in 1996 with classmate Paul Flores. Authorities say Flores killed her while sexually assaulting her in his dorm room. Smart's body was never found, and it wasn't until last year that Flores and his dad were arrested. Prosecutors presented evidence at trial that her body might have been buried beneath the deck of the elder Flores's home. But Ruben Flores maintains he and his son had nothing to do with Smart's murder. All, all that stuff they say is evidence. You look through it and there is no evidence against anybody, me or Paul. There wasn't any time and, and just uh, too much made up stuff. That's all I can say. Meanwhile, Smart's family says they'll never be at peace. To our Kristen, almost three decades ago, our lives were irreparably changed on the night you disappeared. There's not a lot of joy in a way because Kristen's body has still not been discovered. 